Now this is the final plate in this series of Baphomet, and these are cartoon depictions in Freemasonry of the admiration and exaltation of the goat. And now biblically we, we should understand that uh, Jesus said that he is the good shepherd and that his sheep know him and follow him. So this distinct distinction between the sheep and the goat. Sheep are the good, and the Bible also says we all we like sheep have gone astray, and Jesus comes after us, uh, even leaving um, uh, the flock behind to go after even just one that goes astray. So his love for us in this fashion. And so we are the sheep. I am considered of that. Jesus is also the Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. So in this case, he is the sacrificial lamb. So understanding this idea that there is an opposition between goats and sheep, and in this case, they are the goats, which are the evil ones. And that is a reference to that, and they admire this. So they have this riding the goat, the first degree, or are you a mason? And it's clear then to understand that they're in opposition to the Bible. When they may look like they're following the Bible, have a Bible in the lodge, put place their hand on a Bible, wear a cross, all of this stuff is our smoke screens to have you believe otherwise. So we have here the Grand Lodge in season, them hanging out with goats, riding the goats. Are you a mason? Look at these, all of these cartoons. I'm going to quickly move through these. Passing. You can't get a Mason's goat. The password, don't tell the wife. So do you really want to be married to a Mason who's not going to uh, tell? So this is a part of this brotherhood. Are you a Mason? Riding the goat again, so we can understand this fascination.